thought we'd begin today, um, today's Explorers with this Bible verse uh, here, or a little part of a Bible verse. It's actually from Isaiah chapter 40, verse 31. But those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles. They will run and not grow weary. They will walk and not be faint. What a great promise when we put our hope in the Lord that he uh, sustains us. Maybe you remember that when you're feeling uh, worn and t- worn out and tired, as we all get uh, sometimes. Um, but on with the worksheet, right? When Jesus was tempted, he resisted Satan. And uh, we've got to read our scripture lesson. Whoa, just one little bit to look at this week. Normally it's like two or three, isn't it? You're getting off lightly this week. Matthew 4, verses 1 to 11. So pause it now and read that. Okie doke. Now, oh, we've got a word, word search um, to fill in here. Um, so we may struggle a little bit with that because you don't have the actual sheet. But we will go boldly on and see what happens. You've got the word bank here to take the words from, to put in the gaps. Okay, fill in the blanks using the word bank. Okay, Satan tempted Jesus because Satan wanted Jesus to something so that Jesus could not be our deliverer. Wanted Jesus to, what's the answer to that? Sin, I hear you say. Yep, that's the answer. Sure you got it. Number two, Satan tried to make Jesus worship him. Satan wanted to to take something position. God's position. So he always wants to be, uh, he thinks he should be the Lord. Of course he can't be. Number three. Jesus refused to turn the stones into bread because his something did not tell him to do this. Jesus would do only those things his father told him to do. Well, we picked up the answer there from the second sentence. His father. We love it when they give you a little clue like that. Number four. Knowing and Something, God's word, is more important than having food to eat. This is such an awesome point. Knowing and something, God's word. What do you think? Believing. Knowing and believing God's word is more important than having food to eat. Number five. Satan knows God's word, but he twists it for his own evil something. Does that narrow it down? Purposes. He's a liar and a distorter of God's word, the truth. Number six, Satan could offer Jesus the position of something over all the world because when Adam obeyed Satan, Satan became the ruler over Adam and all the human race. Satan could offer Jesus the position of I think the answer is ruler. Seven, Jesus fought against Satan by using, what did he use? Not a sword, not his fists. God's word, it's powerful, sharper than any double-edged sword. That's really sharp. Uh, Jesus greater than Satan. Jesus is something, the one who created Lucifer, Satan, who rebelled against him. One day Jesus will throw Satan into the lake of fire. Jesus is God. One day he'll throw Satan into the lake of fire. Satan is defeated now. So Satan is defeated now because Christ defeated him at the cross. Uh, but he's still causing trouble. 
and he's waiting to be thrown into the lake of fire. That's going to happen. God the Father has said that, that that's going to happen. Right, so thanks for doing our worksheet this week. Hope that you've been watching Sunday School Unscripted and enjoying those videos uh, from St John's Hensingham. And uh, get in touch if we can be praying for anything uh, or help in any way. And we look forward to chatting again soon. Bye!